Are we born in sin? You think about what well, what do you mean by that? Well, here's what I mean. If you read the denominational quotes, you find one man who said the Bible teaches that we're born sinners with a sinful, selfish nature. Humanity is totally depraved. We all have a sinful nature that affects every part of us. We're born with this sinful nature that we inherited from Adam. Every one of us was affected by Adam's sin. There are no exceptions. Even children have sinful nature, which argues for the fact that we're born sinners. We're unable to do good in order to please God in our natural state. Is that true? No. Again, we look to the Bible and we say, okay, what is that? Well, that's a doctrine of Calvinism that was developed in many denominations have at least part and parcel of Calvinism, but it's founded upon the idea that we're totally depraved. But what does God say? In the book of Ezekiel, the 18th chapter, you find in verse 20, that it says, the soul that sinneth, it shall die. The son shall not bear the iniquity of the father, neither shall the father bear the iniquity of the son. The righteousness of the righteous shall be upon him, and the wickedness of the wicked shall be upon him. If total depravity is true, that passage is false. You find further that the Lord made it plain that this is not true in the book of Matthew, the 18th chapter in verse 3, whenever he said, except ye be converted and become as little children, ye'll not enter into the kingdom of heaven. If children are born sinful, they're totally depraved, we've got to become little sinners to be saved? No, we're saved from sin that we ourselves commit. We find in the book of Colossians, the first chapter in verse 21, we're alienated by our mind, by our wicked works, but we can be reconciled. Sin is real, but it's something we commit, not that we inherit. I pray that each of us looks to the plan that God has given, and we love him enough to keep his commandments, John 14 and verse 15. When we fail to do that, we sin. Thank you for listening. If we can help you in this study, feel free to contact us.